The undeniable Cody Rhodes is back. And ready to stake his claim atop WWE. The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. A man who's made it his mission to show the power of the Rhodes name. The son of the dream who is set to become every competitor's worst nightmare in WWE. The most dominant competitor in WWE history. And his opponent, from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! The Beast Incarnate has been involved in some of WWE's biggest matches. He's always a spectacle to see in action. And there are undoubtedly more unforgettable moments on their way. It's time to do it the Cowboy way. He truly seems to enjoy combat. Of course, Cole, because it's what Lesnar was built for. The battlefield is his home. Yeah, Brock Lesnar relishes the chance to go out and simply conquer. Because Brock wants to be on the very top of the mountain. And he won't be denied. Here we go, guys. Hell in a Cell. Only way you win is by pinfall and submission. Nowhere to escape. The Cell designed to torture, designed to contain, truly nowhere to run. It finds a counter. Coming in hot. Returning to the ring now. Just rubbing salt in the wound now. It has to be demoralizing to just get slapped like that. If that doesn't fire you up, I don't know what will. Uh-oh, this is just vicious, vicious arm stop. And now the most dangerous area inside the cell. I guarantee that chair is not going to be used as it was designed for. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. Ooh. What an Iron Man Charm. Obviously, an Iron Man match is a major test of a superstar's endurance. What do you think this match is going to come down to? It's all about cardio, Cole. Whoever can base themselves better is going to have a big leg up as the minutes continue to tick away. Oh, an overhand punch. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. Oh, is he gonna tap out? He may! He 
positioning himself, closing in. Cody Rhodes with a good and Cody And shoulders are down. Two count. Oh, almost. If the count had been even a millisecond faster, things would be over. Continues to rage on with no superstar willing to give an inch. Ooh. Oh man. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. This is not good. You don't say, Saxton. Right now, Brock needs to find the form that has made him a dominant force. Boom! He'll head to the ring. What are they doing here? Out of the ring and into hell itself. A table, the WWE Universe is going wild. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. No, oh, oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. He gets back into the ring. And we get a rare look in the face of Brock Lesnar. You're not supposed to get up after Lesnar brings you down. It's been a struggle for these competitors to find an end to this match. But the struggle's worth it. With every move you make, you'll hear this capacity crowd following you on that journey. Ooh, he retaliates. Rhodes showing his opponent how confident he is. This match is brutality starting to show on him. No matter what, you have to be happy with yourself for the effort you put inside the cell. Yeah, but you'd be happier with the win. Strong overhead chops. Down the middle. For the pin and the win. Yes. He gets one there. He moves just in time. He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. Oh, just floating through the air. Rose looking to end this. Through the table. Through the table. They just went crashing through the table. If this were a tables match, Saxon, I'd say Mazeltov. Instead, I'll just say... My condolences. Face first into the chair. Ooh. He clearly has dangerous intentions in mind here, gentlemen. Lesnar works hard. 
Vicious right forearm. The bear hug cinched in. Gotta find a way out and catch your breath. Look at this. No quit whatsoever. Raining out elbows and escaping the bear hug. For something in the corner. That sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Oh, no, Robin. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Catches an uppercut. Oh, 
shot to the gut will break things up. I can see up to the rafters, and there's not a single person sitting down. What an environment this is. All eyes are glued on this battle. He clearly has no regard for his own well being. He gave you the first hit, Myron. If you're looking for danger, you have come to the right place. Amen. I wasn't looking. Look at Lesnar. WWE Universe knows he's the most dangerous man in the building. Cody Rhodes, murder breaker! Closed fist punch to the jump. That's one way to break up a move. Where do these superstars get the idea to do this? I don't know, but if this is something they dreamt up, I wouldn't want to know what their nightmares look like. Hoisting their opponent. Oh, Fisherman's Buster! There are heights, and then there are heights. Being at the top of hell in a cell, tensions high and tempers even higher as we're seeing. No chance of cooler heads prevailing here. And down with the suplex. How can they even compete up there? How are they not frozen with fear? When you hold this much contempt for your opponent, you'll do anything you have to to drag him to hell. And that was a rough landing from that toss. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. Uh-oh. Full mount. Hammer fists. Striking at will. The ref might want to stop this one. I don't think anybody can stop the beast in Cardiff. Guys, we can see the top of the cell. Breaking apart. Somebody has got to get them down before things go 
goes south in a hurry. Headlock since then is just tough without regard. He takes control. And Cody puts a stop to the momentum that was mounting against him. Cody Rhodes tipping the scales a bit here. Pick the wind right out of you. We have descended to the last circle of hell, gentlemen. Lesnar is getting the whole crowd behind him now. I'm not so sure he knows what he's doing, guys. Who are you to question him? Resilience. Talk about endurance. Really, talk about stubbornness. It certainly paid off here tonight, but who knows if that'll be the case next time around.